Oh. Yeah, it's really hard to catch onto a Riven who's just so mobile with the abilities. But right now, you see an Ocelot coming around to the side. They do actually not get the red buff, so they do protect it here. But even Nip coming in, they're going for killing Ocelot. Yeah, going in there. Flash away, actually, from that first knock up. The red buff is still actually attacking Nip, and he's going to go very low. And it's finished off, and it's Shocks that comes around the hero of the day. And she picks up the kill, but the smite still. Yeah, that's nice from Svenskrim, but you have to wonder whether he'll get away from all that stun and slow. No, he won't. That's a kill for Dexter. So actually, coming out two for one on top of this one. Yeah, wow. So, S or not SK, sorry, Black Sword Dream Team doing very well right there. And even chasing Candy Pen out of the lane. And he's going back in for a fight here, but I'm pretty sure he's not going to be able to pick up the kill. Yeah, actually, in my opinion, he needs to be a little bit careful from this one because Enraiden can control him pretty well. Obviously, he can life steal back, has that blood well as well to fall back on should he need to. As the slow comes in, that's going to stop Shocks really getting in there, but flashing in, that was a little bit premature there, Shocks. I think she thought she was going to do more damage oh, look, it's gone from than behind, actually though. happened. There is that slow coming down, and here is Alistair and Shocks, I'm afraid. You are going to go down for a second time. Trying to pop Candy Panda's blood well and will manage to do that. So <laughs> not all bad. And now they're just toying with her. Actually, barrier use here and they're going to give her a kill. <laughs> That's nice of them. That's very uh. nice. But now Jezus is going to kill her. <laughs> I, 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 I have no words. Candy Panda. Have any team. Meanwhile, in the bottom lane, Enraten is going to fall from this one. Nif going very, very low, but Shox has now decided it's probably time to run away from this one. Going to get slowed, though. Got no flash available. Candy Panda, though, not pushing out for the kill. Oh, they're uh, going to go for dive. Yeah, Nif. Nif. That was the. That was not a good dive, Nif. That is why you play support, Nif. That's why you're not an AD carry or any other role. Because you died for no reason. Well, I think it was just a lack of communication there. I'm going to be on Nif's side for this one. Candy Panda should have followed him with him. Scumbag Candy Panda. All right, I'll be with you on that he one. Might kill her now, though. But right now, Sven Skaren's coming down as well. And yeah. he's going to be spotted by a ward here. But oh. Candy Panda going in. Gets the slow. Yeah, slow. They're not even attempting to be dodged away from by Shocks. But Candy Panda, he is going to find himself locked up and can't find the kill. Shocks is on form. 4 2 1 now. And she has zero CS at the same time. She's just she's farming champions instead of minions and getting all the gold from that. And you do see right now Svenskaren coming from the backside. Gonna go for Enraider, but Shocks is coming. Yeah, coming in from this one. The question is whether he's gonna go to those projectiles. Not getting through. He goes under the tower, but Shocks comes out again. Still alive. Gets a red buff. 5 to one Shocks is a beast. Since when does an AD carry ever have more kills than CS? <laughs> I don't think that ever happens That's right shock now. That's Shocks style. That is shock style. And She's got to be careful though, she's not sitting on too much health and Niv has returned back to lane, he does have flash, he does have ignite, they could pick up a kill. 